What's going on, Nature and Family? Mike here. You guys ready to go on an adventure? As you can see, we have the tent loaded up, getting the car set up right now, travel Kia, and uh, yeah, we're gonna load it up. We're getting ready to meet History Hunting with Tom. So we're gonna load up the car, get rolling. Hope you guys are ready for an adventure. So if you're not subbed, hit that sub button down below. Come with us on all these adventures. And Nature and Family, are you ready for this? Let's go do it. Let's go meet up with Tom. Well, Nature and Fam, getting the car ready to go. We got our water, we got our food, we got our snacks. Tent bags all loaded up. Let's get ready to go on this journey, guys. We're on the location, history hunting. Tom out there in the background, getting his gear all squared away. As you can see, backpack is set here and have a little bit more gear we're going to be bringing up so yeah guys it's gonna be a little hike all uphill so i'll bring you back when we get a little closer to the trail so nature and family this is the trail ahead that we will be taking to one of our spots we're gonna be camping tonight and again uh as i was pulling in the sky was looking a little cloudy we're expecting um, rain after midnight we did have the possibility of storms that's not gonna rule we're not gonna rule that out but we're gonna keep carrying on and hopefully make it uphill soon and get this camp set up well nature family we've been hiking for a little bit now Tom's out there grabbing some views you can see the dark skies right above us. That's the environment we're in. We're going to be setting up camp shortly. So stay tuned. We'll bring you back to camp. Here's our view looking over the highway. American flag ripping. We got a beautiful view out here. And again, you can see the clouds coming in. And the blue skies disappearing. So we're going to hustle back off trail and get our camp going. So, Tom, you ready? Let's get these tents set up or what? Oh, yeah. <laughs> the enthusiasm just raining out of them. Well, we're making our way down to the potential site we just found just off the main viewing area where we're going to be checking out tonight hopefully get a live stream going if we have the reception so but yeah we are finally in the woods getting ready to set up so once we do i'll have that footage for you let's get ready Spend the night. <laughs> well, nature and family, here we are at the spot. As you can see, it is quite noisy. We are camping above 81, doing a little stealth camp today. Myself and History Hunting with Tom. He's setting up one of the bungees here that's going to be. Uh, covering with a, a main a big main tarp and we're gonna have our tents underneath that in case it rains so he's gonna get that set up we're gonna throw a tarp over that and then we're gonna get our tent set up I'm gonna see if he needs a hand real quick with his and uh, we're gonna be up and running soon we're gonna put our two tents here, and then we're gonna have the tarp running over the top for some added support. And we're gonna blow up our bags, get our tents ready, and then maybe make a fire pit and get ready for tonight. We got Mr. Knots over here. Trying to get these knots tied.
All right, nature and family. Again, we're right next to the highway here. We're just finishing up the final setups. You see, here's my bunker over here. We have Tom set up over on the other side. His head pokes out the other side, but putting the finishing touches here. And then we're probably gonna set up a fire pit, get some fire going, clear some of these bugs out. And yeah, guys, we're gonna be camping up here tonight. Here's a look of our uh, view right behind us. We have some nice woods. And where we're stealth camping. Right alongside the highway today, guys. And we'll get some good views for you in a little while once we're all set up. But I gotta thank you guys so much for joining me on these random adventures. Again, I'm happy Tom came along and is joining me out here on this first camp out. And again, we're expecting some poor weather. That's the only reason why we have this big tarp up. But we're gonna get this set up and get a fire pit going, guys. So stick to, so stay with us. So I just left, uh, just left our camp area over there. And we're gonna come over. There's a whole pile of bricks here that we're gonna grab and build our own little fire pit, as you can see. Tons of bricks. There's actually a fire pit that's built right ahead of it. But we're gonna make our own and hopefully get eaten. I'm pretty hungry, guys. Wait for the sun to set. And then we'll give you a nice view of the overlook, which is just ahead, so. Stay with us, guys. This is taking a little bit longer than expected. We had a grueling hike uphill, carrying all of our equipment, but this should be a good one tonight. We got bricks. <laughs> guys. Oh, well, here we are, nature and family. Tom's getting the fire going. Got a little bit of some sticks and stuff here to get it going. Hopefully uh, in a few minutes we'll get this fire nice and roaring, get some food on there. Brought some cheddar hot dogs, some other things to eat. So it's gonna be awesome. I'm starving guys. Yeah. So we'll let this fire build up and I'll give you a look at my tent set up here for the day. Again, nothing crazy. Just right here inside. See if I can open this up for you one. 
Here's the setup. Have the lamp in there. Sleep mattress down. We have our uh, pillow up front. Yeah, nothing too crazy, just a single, single person tent. And again, it looks, that's how it is. We have the big rain guard set up. And Tom has his fire going here. I'm gonna put you back on the tripod now and uh, yeah, we're gonna get this fire going. So here we are, fire roaring. Tom's back, cutting some more trees down. Uh, we're just gonna let the embers go, get some coals down. Fire up uh, a nice meal. Looks good behind us. Camp set up, highway behind us. Uh, rain's supposed to be coming in at nine o'clock. It's just about eight o'clock right now. So we're trying to get some wood prepared for it, maybe get our food out of the way. So if we are uh, dealing with the rain, we could just hunker down in our tent, so. Yeah, guys, this is awesome. First camp out of the year for us, so. Again, I hope this is enjoyable. Hope it's something that you guys will like. We got a long night ahead of us. We got s'mores. Yeah, good time, guys, good time. Well, all right, nature and fam, it's time. I'm starving. I'm gonna get down, throw a couple hot dogs on the grill. Probably gonna cook them all. Pull this away from the fire a little bit. There we go, we got some uh, cheddar dogs on right now. Hopefully when they cook up, we got the buns, ketchup, mustard. It's gonna be delicious. So here we are, back on the grill. Gonna try spinning these dogs around. Again, I'm starving, didn't eat anything really all day. Had work today, hiked all the way up. So, it's gonna be well worth it. Better bright your appetite. You got a lot of dogs to eat. Here we are, we're getting down. Dogs are cooking up nicely. Oh, there we go, we got a light on. I should really have my headlamp on. Dogs are cooking beautifully. Nice little char on some of them. Be almost ready in no time. So I try to keep them up off towards the edge so they don't burn. Continue to cook nicely. 
But next time we bring you back, guys, we'll be, be chowing down on some hot dogs. Look at that beautiful shot. It's gonna be delicious. There we go guys, plate of hot dogs. Rain's starting to come down. We're gonna take this grate off. Keep the fire built up. And let's eat up some good food. Well guys, we're tucked underneath the tarp. Just having a little hot dog action. Might not be able to see any of this, but they are delicious, and we are eating good. Well, Nature fam, if you look out behind me, we are above the lookout spot. The highway is right in this area here. You can see the flag blowing and the trees going. We have some bad weather coming ahead. So, hopefully we can make it through this. If it starts to storm, I'll bring it back and I will uh, let you guys listen in, but so far so good out here tonight. So here we are, just hanging out back by the fire. We got marshmallows out here. Time is the marshmallows, we're gonna roast those puppy up. Hopefully. We got the uh, chocolate back at the car. Rookie mistake. But. There we go, guys. Perfect tomorrow. But well, yeah, we're waiting on the storm. Pitch black around us. Just enjoying company of the fire and these delicious marshmallows. Hey right, Tom. You better believe it. <laughs> well, nature and family, we are in the tent for this evening. Tom. What? <laughs> I said, we're finally in the tents. <laughs> About to get some sleep. Hopefully when we wake up in the morning, it'll be beautiful outside, but yeah. This is the, this is the tent, guys. One person, that roomy. We're making do. We're gonna call it a night. We'll catch you guys in the morning. Here's the next morning. I'm all packed up over there. Tom's getting his gear ready. Couldn't film much last night. We packed in early. We had a little rain too, so we couldn't get the equipment too wet, but yeah, here we are set up. Getting ready to get out of here about 6 a.m. Tired, guys, tired. What's up, nature and family? Well, not my normal outro. Usually I'm hiking back to my car. This time I'm actually in the car. It's raining outside. We just got the gear packed up. I'm actually home now. Uh, it was raining pretty heavy when we started packing up and going and I couldn't have all my equipment out getting wet, but we survived the night. Incredible. First time doing this. Uh, so yeah, it was great. We hiked in a mile uphill, sweat it, up, sweat it so bad, but it was well worth it. We had a great view of the highway. Wanted to go back and get better ones, but there are like six or seven quads came up at around like 10, 11 o'clock at night, which we thought were hanging out there, but they ended up just going through a back loop. So we stayed back at the tent area and uh, yeah, we had some marshmallows. We had some hot dogs all in all, such a good time. I'm glad Tom came out with me again. I'll leave a link to his Facebook page below history hunting with Tom. He does uh rail to trails, rates them. So definitely go over, check his Facebook page out, say hello. And um, yeah, again, 
this is only the first time there's going to be way more camping just getting our feet wet and uh i know the filming next time will be a lot better hopefully the weather will cooperate and uh yeah we'll definitely make it a, a better experience hopefully we'll camp near some water instead of some traffic but again i had a fun time first for everything first time stealth camping above 81 and uh yeah it was a blast we'll definitely do it again but I'm glad you guys came along and joined me. And if again, you went through that whole video, go ahead and hit that subscription button down below. It helps me a lot, helps the channel grow, makes me go out and find some awesome places for you guys, as well as myself. And again, Naturing family, you guys are the best. Mike from Out Naturing, keep it real guys.